truck carrying thousands of chickens tipped over in Salem and created quite a traffic mess this morning. All roads are open now, but Salem police had to close part of Commercial Street Northeast while they wrangled the chickens still alive after the crash. KPTV's Brian McMillan joins us live from the Fox 12 Mobile News over a look at what exactly happened. Brian? Yes, Sean, as Salem police say many of those chickens did die in the crash and the driver of the truck was taken to the hospital. Salem police are still trying to figure out exactly what caused this crash, but they do believe that speed was a major factor. Investigators say the driver, Patricia Aguilar, was driving too fast for how much she was carrying on the truck. That caused it to flip onto its side as it took a sweeping left-hand turn onto Commercial Street. The crash happened right in front of a Honda, Honda car dealership, damaging cars and scattering chickens everywhere. Police had to close the road for several hours while they sorted the dead and live chickens. The truck also knocked over a pedestrian stoplight, which had to be fixed. We spoke with one woman who saw the aftermath of the crash. I think it's terrible. I mean, I know that these chickens are probably foster chickens that just get butchered, but they don't need to be stunned before they get butchered. And trucks like this carry around 5,400 live chickens, and we're waiting to hear on the condition of the driver. Police have yet to issue any citation. Reporting live in the mobile newsroom, Brian McMillan, the 5 o'clock news.